Police Bumpers Grappler is a nasty little device that mounts to the front of police pursuit cars and stops a car chase right in its tracks, safely and securely. It shoots at a nut that grabs onto the target's rear wheel, wraps around it and completely drags the axle to a stop while destroying the tire. Earlier this year, I went to my first rodeo in Nevada. We got there late, and it was just kids having sack and boot races. Later that day, I went to my second rodeo, where we watched teams of two riders on horseback roping cows on the move. One would lasso the horns, which seemed to be the easy part, then the second would try to get a lasso around one or both rear legs, which would totally bring the beast to a halt. And that second part is exactly what the grappler does, but to a car. Mounting to the front of a standard police truck such as a Tahoe. It's specifically designed to disable the rear wheel of a vehicle in a police chase, bringing them to a quick and safe stop without the use of the pit maneuver that involves nudging the fleeing car so it spins around. Police Bumper is hoping to get the grappler out in the field with police operations around the U.S., touting the fact that it brings cars to a much safer and more controlled stop than spinning them around with the pit technique and it keeps the officer at a safer distance from a potentially dangerous crook when the vehicles come to rest. On the other hand, it's also a pretty bulky system that may not work on all police vehicles, and it's questionable how valuable they'd be if they were only on a few select vehicles in a given jurisdiction. I'm not sure how many police chases there are per day in the United States but you'd want a lot to justify the as yet undisclosed cost of fitting one of these things. So we'll wait and see if it takes off, but it sure makes for some cool video, as you can see below.